A Knox County judge postponing a preliminary hearing this morning for the driver charged in a deadly wreck. This was Franco Francisco Eduardo Cambrani's first court appearance since the head-on collision that took the life of 22-year-old Pierce Corcoran. Investigators say Francisco Eduardo crossed into the wrong side of traffic, hitting Corcoran's car head-on. He now faces charges of criminally negligent homicide, driving without a license and without insurance. In our top story today, WATE 6 on your sides, Blake Stevens is joining us now live from our newsroom. And Blake, you were in court all morning. Why did this hearing get backed up? Yeah, Gabriella, his attorney argues he hasn't had enough time with his client, even telling the judge his client didn't make it back to Knox County until last night. Now, as we've reported, Francisco Eduardo was taken by the Immigration and Customs Enforcement, or ICE, after he bonded out of the Knox County Jail. His attorney telling me if, uh, on the phone a couple days ago, it's hard to prepare for a hearing when you don't have a client. Now the judge granting the defense's request earlier today, the state argued they were ready for a hearing. A, wet, a witness was set to testify. They also pointed out there would be no guarantee Francisco Eduardo would be transported by ICE back to Knox County for another hearing. And to make sure Francisco Eduardo would be back in Knox County for another hearing, the judge revoked his bond. Francisco Eduardo had previously paid a $3,500 bond. That's when ICE picked him up. And because that bond has been revoked now, we are told he will stay in Knox County through the next hearing. Back to you, Gabby. All right, thank you so much, Blake. Now, we have been covering this situation since that wreck happened. Investigators saying Francisco Eduardo crossed over the center line on Chapman Highway, causing a multi-vehicle crash, resulting in the death of 22-year-old Pierce Corcoran. Again, Francisco Eduardo faces charges of criminally negligent homicide as well as already having been charged for a no driver's license and no proof of insurance for his involvement in that deadly crash. This is all on top of an ice hold for an immigration violation. Franco Francisco Eduardo Cambrani will now have the hearing on January 17th. You can count on us to be there as well.